Welcome back everyone. Today at DrupalFreelanceCoders.com we will be discussing on how to add blogs. Now to add blogs first let us go back to our website and click on the structure tab on the main menu. This will list us a few options out of which we have to click on blogs and show us what blogs are listed on our website or displayed on our website. Now what is a block? A block are different boxes on our website surrounding our main content area. Now there's a text showing demonstrate block regions. Let me click on this to make it more clearer. So once we click on this it will show us the different areas where these boxes uh, will be visible. So the main area in between is a main content area. So these are the boxes where our content will be available maybe over the content, over the node, highlight. This is the first sidebar area on the right that is second sidebar. Slightly on the lower region we have the under, under sidebar bars. Sorry. So these are the different boxes which will appear on our website or around the main content area of our website. Now let us exit the block region demonstration. Now there are two ways to um, add blocks. One is the inbuilt blocks which come with the CMS. So if we go here it will show the current blocks right now. So the top bar is uh, visible on this region. So if we go back to our home page this is the top bar. This is the top bar area. Then uh, we have uh, over the content area which shows on the uh, content blog. So these are the different kinds of blogs which are already displayed. Now we have some disabled blocks. Uh, let me click on them to show you better. Now for example I need the who's uh, online block. So let me click here and say I want it in the in the second sidebar or first sidebar. Then let me save this and refresh my home page. So here is the block who's online. It appears here. So th there is a setting tab given for the administrator where we can configure this block. Right? And then let me add another block. For example, I want another block. Okay, I want the search form block. So let me say it should come I think it's gone to the uh, search form. It has gone on the utility menu. I want it on the, of course by mistake, I want it in the second sidebar. So let me save this. And let me now refresh the home page. So yes, this is the search form or the search box which is visible. So these are the inbuilt blocks which, which I can enable and it will appear on my home page or whatever page I'd like. So I can configure this over here. Configure block. And if in case I want it on some other page I can specify it here. Show block on specific pages. All pages except those listed or only on listed pages. For example I want only on the front page. So I'll click as front. So it will show uh, as the it will show only on the front page. Similarly, I want a customized block of my own, something I want to add on my own. So for that, let me go to add block and let me add a block, say block title, contact us, a description, say mm, contains our phone numbers. right? Then the blog body will contain whatever you want to show on this blog. Wait, let me put our numbers here. Text form will be filtered HTML. This is required to avoid spammy links or to prevent security hazards or modification of the code. Then uh, specify in which themes and regions this block is displayed. Ours is Marinelli theme which is the default theme 
and then we can have what pages we want this listed on so let me now save this and let me go back to my home page of course I have to choose the region where the block will appear right now it is disabled so I want it on the second sidebar again let me save this and let me go back to the home page and refresh it yes so this is where a block appears contact us block so in this manner we can add a new block a new and a customized block of our choice or of our requirement so with this we come to the end of this tutorial thank you for listening ladies and gentlemen and do visit us again for more updates and news thank you